Heads up. Remnant sight ahead. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Thank you for following Rylus' tip, Ryder. Taking out these kids will mean a lot to my people. is falling, Pathfinder.
There's a lot of organic material here. Angara, Ket, something else. Scans could tell us more, Pathfinder. There is an audio log saved on this device, Pathfinder. Ket? Let's get a translation, Sam. Processing. The Angara genetic code that expresses this projection of a bioelectric field has been isolated. The process to integrate this into our own genome is ongoing. Early success is documented. Once complete, adaptation should be distributed to all ascendant adherents. Ability may also prove useful as part of base soldier configurations. All research has been transmitted to the Empire. Exaltation is not just about making more cat. It's an exchange. The cat gets stronger while everyone else is annihilated. There's bound to be more here. Let's keep moving. Data saved. Another audio log detected. Let's hear it. Transmissions are acknowledged by whom? Possible breakdown in connection and information mishandled. Investigation ongoing. Logs to be updated shortly. <laughs> Things getting lost in the post. A universal problem. I wonder if we can find the follow-up logs. Cat genetics locked. All transmissions appear to have failed. Some of the team has suggested that this research is being prevented from leaving Helix. Troubling implications. Set aside for now. Taking steps to verify that primary communications are still active. I'm picking up the nav point for another cat station. Probably their primary communications. If we take out that comm station, does that mean the Ket can't call home? Pathfinder, these samples all contain the same genetic sequence. At first, it appears to be a familial connection, but the genome shows signs of modification. Evidence suggests the sequence was drawn from a single individual and incorporated into other cat. The Archon. Exaltation. So does the Archon control the cat because they see him as a progenitor? Or does his rank give him the privilege to propagate his genes like this? Hmm. A cultural question, beyond my purview. In any case, the stuff we found should be of great interest to the science team back on the Nexus.
a severe temperature drop. The Ketib made camp. Be careful, Ryder. This is the Ketcom outpost we heard about on Vold. Got them all. Boost enabled. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. The Archon's not the Ket Supreme Leader. There's more like him, all over Andromeda. All assigned to gather genetic information for the Empire. And making more Ket in the process. Rogues, communication orders require explanation. Archon commands a block of all transmissions among Lara data to the Empire. It's a breach of protocol. Wait, is the Archon going off book? Communications. Only Archon is aware of shifting situation in Helios. If Archon's opinion is that protocols are not to our benefit, accept his wisdom. He is the Senate's voice in Helios and must be obeyed. Someone's repeating the party line. It sounds like the Ket are starting to question what the Archon's doing. If this continues, it might be good for all of us. What do we do with this, then? There is likely nothing to be done, but conflicts between factions seldom resolve quietly. Then we'll just have to keep an ear to the ground for now. With luck, something will happen.
reading a temperature decrease. PB's been looking for you.